So um, I was a bit skeptical about doing this virtually. I felt that the only way we could get the most out of it was to be there in person. But due to COVID and all of the cancellations, we decided to try the virtual one. Um, I have to say that I was extremely impressed with how things were run, how organized everything was, and how true to yourselves with making it a safe place. We were always respected. Nothing was forced. And we were given a lot of tools and things to explore um, and just ways to better communicate with each other. I think it opened our eyes to what's available um, and gave us things to work with uh, within our marriage. I was extremely surprised at how much I learned about myself mm -hmm. and my spouse. You think you know everything about your spouse or at least yourself and how you communicate, and that's not the case. So um, this definitely opened my eyes to how I was acting and how I should be acting and uh, things I can do to make things better um, and how to work on yourself specifically. Because until you're happy with yourself, you can't be happy with the marriage or your spouse. So thank you for that. And, you know, Donna echoes a number of things that she, that I feel appreciative of. Um, she asked me to come to this and I was not eager to come to it. Um, and, but I'm thankful that um, she brought me to it. And uh, actually, Dr. Joe, I think having it virtually makes a whole lot more sense because we hear all that conversation in the breaks, but we can have that conversation privately and not everybody hear what we're talking about. And it has opened up my eyes to both, not only more about Donna, my spouse, um, but more about myself. And I thought I had myself under control, but I, I realized there's some things I need to work on on myself. So thank you very much for that marriage helper. Uh, really appreciate it.